morning everyone welcome back to another vlog uh welcome back to not family adventures i hope you are all well i hope you enjoyed the last video holly is wide awake this morning aren't you making noises wanting to play all Ooh, what you're up to in my vlog miss cheeky down there aren't you <laughs> um it's quite sunny outside i've got about half an hour before i need to go to work so i'm going to try and sort the planters out and the planters that I bought from work, um, just to remind you, were these ones at 2 99 um, The bag inside, I need to just pull out and cut a little hole in the bottom so that when we put the plants and compost in there, the water will just drain through. Um, so that's the first job to do. And then the second job is to put three along the fence, just where we've put the solar lights on the posts. So, post on there one there and one at the back so we'll have three planters along there just under the solar lights which will look really nice at night um and then i'll probably put plants in them later on once we decide which plants are those we would like in there um i think chris wants to put his herbs in there i can't quite remember so um just need to drill some holes and then screws in there but first things first cut the holes in the plastic bags scissors plant up Create a little hole at the bottom. Drain in. One done. Success. Two. I want to go out now. Done. Right, so now I just need to mark where I want it on the fence. Got to think like what flower's going in. third one in the corner we'll have to get a longer screw or string and probably tie it around the post just because it doesn't sit quite properly in the corner um but i can have it at an angle so it worked like that well that's two of them done now i'm going to tie the string um we already bought this from qd or something like that can't remember where but tie it around See if it'll go over. I might get too short, but if so, I'll just cut it off and try again. Yeah, I've done it too short. Oh well. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Holly wants to play all the time, bless her.
Let me know what you guys think. Right, it's now the next day and it has finally stopped raining. It's been raining all morning. So now it's morning to do the plants or put the plants in the planters today. Um, so now it's finally opening up. I can finally do that. Um, I spoke to Chris last night and he just want the herb plants in there. So um, I'll just have a look what herbs we've got that I can use that we bought the other day and then plant them. Right, so we've got some common sage. Some green fennel, garlic chives, and then the thyme. So I've got some soil left over, so I'll put that in the bottom here, and then use the rest of the compost, and then the herbs. Done. Right, so that's those three done. One, two, three. Looks a lot better now there's plants inside them. Look who's home! <laughs> so look who's home! <laughs> Cooking dinner! Lum. What else do you have in? Uh, I've got some dough for my potatoes from work. I'm going to do some crushed minted garden peas, uh, honey roasted carrots, Lovely. And lamb sauce. Where's the lamb sauce? Where's the lamb sauce? Gordon Ramsay reference if no one knows. And then we've got tiramisu for pudding, yeah? Yeah. Ooh. Tiramisu and berries. We're going to have some wine tonight. We're Rune Cove, New Zealand, whatever that is. Uh, I did look this up at one point. I think it's near Auckland. I can't remember where that's from. Sainsbury's maybe? No, Tesco. Oh, Tesco. Yeah, um, because Chris is going to use it for cooking, so might as well have it. Chris is going to let us watch Harry Potter tonight. It's <laughs> <laughs> only so I watch Lord of the Rings, no, it's Harry Potter. I don't like Harry Potter. Well, yeah, but you, you always go Lord of the Rings, Lord of the Rings, and I'm like, well, no. It is better. Harry Potter. <laughs> you must not harm Harry Potter! <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Are you deaf? I said put that light out! <laughs> today. I am, yeah. <laughs> Everyone loves Harry Potter quotes. Even if they say they don't, they do. Look at that poor. Don't worry guys, these glasses are smaller than what they look. They're not massive wine glasses. <laughs> Cheers! Salmon. Happy Friday everyone! Chris is spear in the lamb. Is that right? Yeah. See, I know my <laughs> <laughs> 
standpoint, can you tell me what the reaction tools for this categorization? Boring. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Maillard reaction. The caramelisation of the natural sugars. Maillard? What a weird name. I didn't come up with it. Cat's gone. <laughs> Ignore the blanket, we're using that tonight. <laughs> So guys, let me know your thoughts and comments on the planters over there. Let me know if you like them, what you do differently, what you might add. Chef Chris is making a lot of loud noises, so sorry if you can't hear me. <laughs> is my yard in the lamb? Searing. <laughs> oh, searing the lamb. It's a my yard reaction. <laughs> This is the frying pan I hate because it did that thingy to the ceiling. Boop, boop, boop. You can still see a few spots there, actually. But hey, hope. <sighs> so Chris is now resting the lamb over the frying pan. How, how long were they on the frying pan, roughly? A couple of minutes. Couple of minutes. Like minute, minute and a half each and they're like fairly decent size, so. so yeah. I couldn't tell you to be honest, I'll cook your lamb because I have no idea. <laughs> I would probably just read the packet and follow the instructions online. <laughs> Don't you shrug your eyebrows. <laughs> it's worked for me before with steak and chicken and everything else. <laughs> this has just poured what a small glass into the frying pan pretty much after i've let it cool down a bit because this pan gets very hot, hot. Hot, um, even on a medium so heat. what are you doing here just cooking the just deglazing cooking the alcohol out deglazing <laughs> we'll add it to that stock there start making the sauce Yummy. This wine's quite nice actually. It's very nice. Yeah. Can't remember how much it was, so. Um, I think it was seven. Was it one when it was on off? Or it was, was it? yeah, I got it on the 25% when you buy six or more when they were doing that deal. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's quite nice. Yeah. Another Savion Blanc and all. Mm. Adding the wine to the pan. It's easy. I've just come back in the kitchen and Chris has now transferred it back to the frying pan. I was trying to reduce some of the liquid because it's taken too long in that pan. Ah. I also added another stock so, in. if you're trying to reduce the liquid, put it in a smaller pan. Put it in a wider pan so it has more surface area for the water to boil away. Oh, wider pan. <laughs> Add your rosemary to the pan if you've got rosemary. Which is outside the front for us. Yep. <laughs> Imagine one day we come home from work. I would just come to the front of the house and just see the rosemary bush has been like chopped up by his neighbours and something around us. Oh, I'll add some rosemary, I'll just take some of that. <laughs> don't think anyone would, but... <laughs> I don't know what my, my reaction would probably just be like, okay, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> it'll, come, it'll grow back anyway. I mean, the size it's getting to anyway. Yeah, we could do with it. People like probably cutting a bit off or whatever, but... I want to do that out the front because there's like weeds and stuff growing where the, yeah, you know, where the cars, yeah, where the cars parts, like the plants bits down the side, but 
just need like trimming back and stuff because my car sensor keeps beeping at me now. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. But there's no flowers there. Well, there is, but <laughs> just need quitting back a bit. I don't even know what those flowers are either on the side, like the bark bit. Oh, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> hey ho. <laughs> Can you do the mashed potato, mashed potato? <laughs> what am I on? <laughs> I'm on the wine. <laughs> it's a dangerous thing putting Marie on the wine. Hey, I've only had half a glass. Exactly. No, it's a song. <laughs> it's a kid's song or something. I can't even remember what it is. Can you do the mashed potato? Can you do the hand jazz? <laughs> oh, maybe it's from coaching. Yeah, coaching kids. Yeah, that's what it's from. Okay. Oh, love a bit of mint sauce. Normally I'd use fresh mint, but our fresh mint's still growing. Mint sauce in the mushy beans. And the scoozy. Butter. Unsalted, because that's how I like it. <laughs> oh, mm -hmm. I don't like salty things anyway, so. <laughs> Look at this, dinner is served. How did you do that? How did I do what? The pea thing. Oh. I knew that. Oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> oh, I thought they were bloody baking things. They are. Oh. <laughs> but you can do more than just baking with them. Presentation at its finest. I mean, it smells lovely and it looks lo lovely, so thank you very much. Right. And I'm sure it would taste lovely as well. <laughs> Be careful with Nizer who on. Not everyone can use them like Chris, I definitely can't. The concentration on his face. So what sorts is this? It's basically a uh, white wine and chicken stock sauce with like the... Juice from the lamb. Yeah, thank you. You're <laughs> welcome. Struggling for words there. <laughs> it's been a long day. For dinner and now we're going to put on an episode of mandalorian and then finish up and then put harry potter on harry potter a boy who lived come to die <laughs> two demolished plates that was gorgeous Right, I've just washed all the pots whilst Chris has gone to get a quick shower. I'm going to finish the rest of my lawing off and then watch Harry Potter. Like I said before, Holly's fast asleep. Um, almost knocked uh, Chris's wine glass over, as usual, with a big tail, but can't blame her for that. <laughs> Pudding time! Tiramisu with some berries. 
and Harry Potter.